What's going on guys, Etika from the Etika World Network here and I got some big news for you dudes. Now, I understand the game is not released yet in America, however, people are already discovering exploits for certain things. Now, I'm going to inform you all on something. If you don't know, custom moves are a bitch to get in this game. Like, they're an absolute bitch from the bottom to the top. Now, the thing is, is that usually to get the custom moves in the game, you have to do kind of things like Smash Run, you have to do things like the Classic Mode, you know, you know that whole adventure thing where you choose the things on the map. You have to do those obscure modes. You can't get custom moves through just playing versus mode. You have to do those obscure things. And it takes a long time because there's a lot of custom moves for all these characters, and you can gain them rather slowly because the rewards that you get for doing these side things aren't exactly always going to be custom moves. Sometimes they'll be trophies, sometimes they'll be um, alternate costumes or potential power-ups, I mean alternate costumes for the Mii Fighters or something like that. So, with all that said in mind, you can't really rely on those modes to give you those custom moves really fast. Until the day Ninja Link TS discovered an exploit to get custom moves 100% of the time, which will greatly increase the amount of um, speed where you get your custom moves. So um, I, once again, I want to give a shout out to Ninja Link TS. His link will be in the description below. Check this guy out. He actually has a lot of videos on his channel. Oh, sorry, he has a lot of videos on his channel detailing the character's custom moves. Like as you can see here, you know, um, easy. Um, anyways, he he discovered this new exploit. But um, he has all the character's custom moves here. He's working on a playlist, like a playlist right now. So go check him out. A lot of good stuff on his channel in terms of informational stuff. In case you want to get the jump on anybody when Smash Bros. comes out. But like I was saying, this guy discovered a freaking exploit. And I don't, I don't know, man. This is looking like it's gonna be it. So let's just take a look at exactly what he's talking about. Now, we're gonna, I'm gonna explain it as we go along. I think it's go all the way out, and then um, this is the classic mode or the adventure mode, so to speak, where you um, basically fight challenges along the way. It's basic Smash Brothers classic mode, but I had six to choose from. Let me so explain. Here's the, here's the trick. Okay, doesn't even have Listen. to. Listen, doesn't even matter. He's like, I don't want to build it. Okay. All right. So, you so see I'm gonna pause the screen right now, right? No matter. So, He's whenever like, you start up a fight in classic mode or adventure mode, it. it's gonna show you a screen where you know it's the character that you're fighting, with an awesome ass song in the background, no less. And on the bottom screen, there's going to be a roulette that spins, and this roulette is going to have certain rewards that you can get for winning the battle. So let's just say you're fighting Mega Man, and you beat him. The reward that you get will be one of the things that shows up on the roulette that you hit A button on. So when you hit A button on the roulette, it stops it on either coins, stops it on you know um, this green thing. I don't know exactly what it means, but um, it stops it on coins. You can win coins for winning the battle. You can win um, a lot of different stuff. But if you guys know Smash Brothers 4, the wrench icon always means customs. Now, as you can, you might not be able to see it too well there, but um, the red icon right here is a wrench, and a wrench means custom move. So if you manage to land the roulette on the wrench, then that means that you get a custom move or something in the field of customs, which will most likely be a move as a reward for beating Mega Man. But the roulette spins really fast, so it's kind of tough to get the jump on it until... Okay, so you see the slot? You just do this. There's way too... Oh, it's like, see, it's red now. So what you do is once you hit home, hold A. Done. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> the struggle is over. It's over. The struggle is over, baby. I didn't even attempt to get custom moves because of how difficult it was. But thanks to this new exploit that Ninja Link discovered, it's looking like customs are gonna be something easy now. So what because you with this method, basically let me let, let me explain it to you. If you still don't understand what's going on, like I said, you can win customs on the roulette if you manage to land the roulette on the red wrench icon, right? It's difficult to get it. But if you just press the home button and go back to the home menu, and then when you see the red about to come through on the roulette, you, when you see it about to come down, you basically press the home menu, and then you go back to the game by holding A button down, and it'll choose the red automatically. It's crazy. Now some of you may still be a little bit confused. You know, I'm sorry I'm treating you like as like babies, but um I figured what better way to test this theory out than to do it ourselves. So you know what? I got my Smash Brothers 3DS full version right here. We are about to test this method out that Ninja Link has discovered and see if what he um, found here really is going to do the trick for us. So um, I'm going to start up a classic mode where I'm actually going to get my capture card running here. So that way you guys can observe exactly what the fuck I'm doing. Because, you know, what good will this technique be if we can't do it ourselves right here? Easy, you know? So, 
Let me just get my wires together, plug this thing. There we go. All right. So that's in. I'm gonna get my 3D SO recording. It might have to install the drivers because I'm using a different USB port. Maybe not. Oh, okay, good. So I'm gonna start it up. Vroom, vroom. There we go. Okay, so I have both screens visible here so you guys can see exactly what's going to go down. So let's move back. We're gonna go to classic mode. Now we're going to go to, of course, choose my main. The only player that I beat classic mode with was Robin, as you can see here. No one else has a score. No one but Robin. Because Robin's amazing. We're going to choose him. And we're just going to choose this on 9 difficulty. Why not? I'm probably going to regret this, but eh. So classic mode. You walk and choose your opponent. Let's choose um, Game & Watch, right? Alright, so now, we, we you see the bottom screen, right? It's a red wrench. Red wrench. Now, if we hold a button from the home screen on that, then we should get it. <laughs> the struggle is over. It's over. The struggle is over. That's it. You just saw it confirmed here on the Etical World Network by Ninja Link's initial video. You can now get custom moves in Smash Brothers 3DS extremely easy, my friends. This is massive. This is a huge discovery. A massive shout out to Ninja Link. His, the, the original video is going to be in the description below. That's crazy, man. I can't believe I can't believe it's made this easy now. This is insane. And let's just beat let's just beat Game Watch to see if we do get a custom move, which we of course will, since you know we obviously just got it in the roulette. Let's just fuck him up real quick. Can't believe people use items in this. Like, come on, what? I hate items, man. I swear. I mean, they're funny, but what the hell was that? God damn it! And let's see what we get as a reward. All right, we did get custom items here, but uh, none of them are moves. Let's try this one more time. Um, I, can't, I wish I could have read what those are, but we didn't get any custom moves there. But we're gonna go for the custom wrench icon again, of course. Let's fight Paku Paku. Well, that's giant Paku Paku. Mm -hmm. Oh, I'm supposed to do the exploit. Whoops. Okay. Um, Okay, so we don't see a red wrench yet. I might have missed it. I might have just missed it. Nope, we didn't miss it. Okay, now you hold A button. I cannot believe how foolproof this is. Like, holy crap. Oh, man. I hope this can't get patched, you know, because that this is an amazing exploit. All right, let's just beat up giant Pac-Man real quick. Don't go next to that. Yeah, hey, this dude's fucking me up. You know what, since items are here, look how big the fucking fire hydrant is. Since items are here, we might as well freaking just use them. There we go. There we go. Can I grab his big ass? No homo. Yeah, I can. Yeah, this dude is huge. You know what, since he's so massive, I think maybe I can um, hit him with a multi-hit move. Damn it, this bastard moves really fast. Really far. What? How did he? This this partner of mine is not doing shit. I hate items so bad. What? Get the hell out of here, Pac-Man. Yo, what is Meta Knight doing? He's not even here. God. Damn it! All right, so let's see what customs we got. Sure enough, we got three, three custom moves for Robin. My friends, spread it, spread this exploit around, spread it around. This is official. This needs to get, this needs to go crazy. Everyone in this match community needs to know this. This is insane. So, um, all right, once again. I'm going to end that gameplay. Alrighty, I'm, I'm going to be in a good mood today. I'll probably have all the custom moves um, gathered before the end of the day. But um, once again, Ninja Link TS, 
thank you for discovering this exploit and as you guys saw i just did it on camera it works 100 percent foolproof so um get to work in as soon as the game comes out you know what to do um if you do have the game currently you know what to do and um i'll talk to you guys in the next video um i'll t <laughs> i just said that take care of yourselves and of course as usual please have yourself a damn good one